Hey everybody, this is a uh, HP tablet. It's got a 128 uh, gig uh, chip inside of it, no restore CDs. Okay, so it didn't even come any, any cables or anything like that. So uh, what I'm going to do is I'm, I'm doing a test on this for the company. It's uh, called Mini Tool, uh, and they, uh, they're coming out with a Shadow Maker. All right, so over here I have an external drive. I already tested it on the 500. It worked great. But I lost the 500. Once you make the disc, you cannot use the disc again on this computer. All right, and I'll show, I'll tell you why. So what I what I have here is an old 250 gig. Okay, and I'm going to hook this up. I just have to close this and plug in the USB, and it will be up here, and I'll show you it on the computer too. All right, and uh, I'm going to switch to the desktop so you can actually see what goes on. Before we get started, I want to show you something. This is my, my hard drive. This is a 128 that's inside my computer, the tablet computer, Windows 10. This is my one that's uh, the, uh, the SD drive that's on the side. Uh, this is the HP tablet backup drive that I labeled. It's a 250 gig. Okay, so you can see it here. The key thing is that you see it right here, right now. All right, everybody, here's the website. I will put this in the description uh, so you can click on it. All right, it's for limited time. It's a beta version, and I'm not sure how much it's going to cost at the final. Uh, you can click here or here to download it. You can scroll down to see more information, and here's all the tools. Be sure that while you're here that you're actually testing out. You see the, uh, the ISO and Android stuff, and there's a lot, of, a lot of cool stuff here. While you're here, check it out. Okay, when you do the download, uh, what you're going to do is go go to your um, go to your download directory, and that's where it's going to be. And you double click on this to do the install. Once you get the install, it'll be on your desktop. You go up to Mini Tool Shadow. Uh, you hit yes at the uh, prompt if you want to do it. This is if you're hooked up to a remote. Okay, and you can type in that. Over here, we want to connect to something on this computer. Connect. This little splash screen is going to come up for a while. At the first time it came up to share on Facebook, do that and just exit that and it'll come up here. All right. This is if you're going to start your normal backups. I'm going to go to Tools. And over here is Clone a Disk. We're going to click on that. There's no disk selected, so I click here to select a disk. All right. I want to bring this down and make sure that I'm actually selecting my disk. It's labeled as Disk 2. All right. And then I hit Finish. The Target. I'm going to drag this down, and I want to do the Hitachi. All right, that's my big uh, 250. Hit Finish. All right, hit OK. It's going to warn me that everything on the target drive is going to be destroyed. Hit Yes, and just sit back and watch it happen. It takes a while for it to spin up and sync, and here it goes. It does a calculation here, and it, um, it does take a while, and you have the option to shut down and get help. All right, cancel out. So uh, this is the time running, remaining time calculating. So it hasn't actually started yet. So uh, so my light is on and flashing on the external drive, and now, now we have time remaining. It's going to it's saying about uh, 42, 40 minutes remaining. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring you back, and, and um, when this is done, I'm going to show you the message that comes up afterwards. All right, that was relatively faster than uh, the time it was saying. So um, it says, please shut down, be uh, disconnected from the Ethernet or original hard drive. That's in case you're doing it over the Internet uh, or the target drive, because when you boot, they're both the C drive. Okay, so now I want to show you, um, uh, do you want to restart now? No, I, I want to close that. I want to cancel this. I want to cancel that. And I'm going to close this. Now, I want to show you something now. I'm going to go back to my uh, my folders, and now you don't see the hard drive anymore, okay? Because there's a conflict. In fact, if I uh, if I go to uh, I'm I'm actually going to go to disk management, and I want to show you something. Okay, disk management is a really cool tool, um, and th this might be another YouTube video I'll make. All right, so uh, right here, here they are. All right, now this guy is offline. So if you put your mouse over, it says offline because the signature co uh, collision with another drive online. So this is a, a clone of the C drive. All right, but you see that's the amount that's actually used. Now over on my actual C drive, that's the amount. So it made a clone of that, 63 megabytes. All right, so 63 megabytes. 
and that's that's what's left over. So I uh, hope you like the video. 